hey guys welcome back for another video and in today's video it is gonna be a bit different today we are gonna talk about the galaxy z fold 2 explaining things easily and why it is a much better upgrade over the galaxy fold 1 so let's start but first we tell you a bit about what i have guessed about the fold revolution so let's see the fold revolution now with every competition on our with other brands samsung decided to make a step ahead and in around october to january 2019 i don't remember exactly they decided to launch the galaxy z fold one it was it was priced at 1,65,000 then with flagship specs but it was certainly overpriced also samsung claimed that they had sold one lakh plus units of it then they launched the galaxy z flip which was a good one but badly flopped due to its poor build quality and development then they decided to merge its upcoming fashion phones with a new series, the Z series. Now, so the Galaxy Fold 2 is now the Z Fold 2. So they have named it the Z series, they have put it in the Z series and probably the Z series is the main reason why Samsung is discontinuing the Note series from 2021. Anyways, now let's get back to the video. Now, this is the image of the Galaxy Fold 1. Looks beautiful, of course yes. It was Samsung's first ever so-called invention. It was quite successful in comparison to the Moto Razr 1 though. Its problems were weak build, weaker flexing and versatility, normal cameras not so good in expectance to the price. Fold 1 has a smaller exterior display. The cover screen of Fold 1 has grown from 4.6 inch to 6.2 inch now in the Fold 2. The display of Fold 1 was also kinda small. I am talking about the bigger one, 7.3 inch. The Fold 1 had a pretty ugly big notch. That notch is very irritating and it, it has been turned to a punch hole selfie camera in the Galaxy Fold 2. Even the refresh rate in the Fold 1, although being a flagship, had 60Hz refresh rate. But in the, in, at the time, many phones had already got the 90Hz refresh rate in AMOLED displays. But still, Fold failed to do that. So now in the Fold 2, Samsung has decided to go to, with the adaptive refresh rate option. Another problem of Fold was that many of the apps just were like blow up phone apps in tablet mode. But these problems are solved in this one. We are talking, we are going to talk about that later. So now, let's look at the improvements Samsung made in Fold 2 overall. First improvement is the bigger display. We had 6.2 inches and 7.6 inches. The smaller display is the compact display is a 6.2 inch and the big tablet size display is 7.6 inches. The durability has also been increased. Samsung says that it, it comes with ultra thin glass and hideaway edge uses sweeper technology to keep away debris. It is even protected by the latest Gorilla Glass 7 or the Corning Gorilla Glass Victus. It has a new flex mode. Now what is flex mode? It is a new camera mechanism and which allows one person to open the Z Fold 2 at various angles and enjoy the new flex mode software experiences like dividing the phone in three apps. This was also present in the Fold 1 but it felt like blow up option. But in this one Samsung has joined hands with many third party apps as well. It makes the phone more versatile. The flex mode is supported by Samsung apps like Camera, Gallery, Player, Clock, Calendar and other apps like YouTube, Google Duo and I already told you third party apps thing. Now the third thing is a more multitasking option. New multi active window lets us pair apps to launch instantly and it is easier to rearrange in comparison to the Z Fold 1. Now the Z Fold 2 has better processor and a battery. Now the processor if you see Z Fold had around 855 I think or 855 plus and this one has the 865 plus 5G. The main problem of Z Fold 1 was despite being priced at 1,65,000, despite being promised as a future phone, it did not have 5G. But the Z Fold 2 does have 5G. Plus it has a better battery. The battery has not been much upgraded but still better. 4300 mAh was present in the Fold 1 whereas the Fold 2 has a 4500 mAh battery along with a 25 watt of fast charging. Uh, there are new camera features here the old the old fold camera design was not that good but this one is similar to the note 20 lineup the new camera features are 12 megapixel triple cameras the all 12 plus 12 plus 12 mp one is wide angle another is ultra wide and another is telephoto now better display i already told you that 120 hertz refresh rate which is adaptive and but the covered display of the Galaxy Z Fold 2, the smaller display, does not offer 120Hz. It is still stuck to the 60Hz. It has a, it is an OLED display, but it is still better than the Fold 1 because it is slightly bigger. 
Uh, now another let's get back to the camera again the dual preview is present in this phone that that's let's one see how they're going to look using front display while you are clicking pictures that's a really good thing because your friends complain if you click bad pictures of them also rear camera can be a selfie camera and now that's something amazing the fold one also supported that but the fold 2 has better cameras now let's come to the sound effect you must have seen technical guruji's video about the sound now it has enhanced video effect high dynamic dual speakers now dual speakers you can see in the image let me show you a bit clearly this is the image of the dual speakers and so the, there are two variants of this phone 12 gb ram accompanied with 256 gb storage and another is 12 gb ram accompanied with 512 gb storage now coming to the colors it has two colors mystic black and mystic bronze now these colors are similar to the galaxy note 20 lineup you can also choose from a variety of edge colors and customize as you like with premium leather covers samsung had told this in their launch event let's talk about the price which is probably the most the worst thing in the video right now the price is two thousand dollars or one triple nine dollar so yeah it is obviously overpriced because but it took much money to make it and now if you convert it the price will be around 1.6 or 7 lakhs yeah probably that or 1.6 or 5 lakhs around now we are going to talk about their specs the four specs of the galaxy fold 2 at a glance 7.6 inch 120 hertz amoled display 6.2 inch cover 60 hertz oled display snapdragon 865 plus 5g processor up to 12 gb plus 512 gb ram and storage 12 plus 12 plus 12 cameras triple cameras 10 megapixel cover selfie camera and another selfie camera on the main display uh, 4500 milliampere battery the sizes are 6.2 into 2.6 into 0.66 inches when closed and 6.2 into 5 into 0.27 inches when opened the weight is around 9.9 .9 ounces now we come to the last segment of the video where we are going to talk about the special edition of the Galaxy Z Fold 2, the Tom Brown edition. It's a pretty premium edition. The color is beautiful, grey, red, so many colors are mixed. Z Flip also had this edition. It looks pretty nice. Now you decide you want to buy it or not because it costs much more. The price is front of your screen and oh my god it's so high. Anyways. Thanks for watching and do like, subscribe, share and comment and we'll be back with our next video soon. So till then stay tuned and please subscribe. So bye.